everyone. This video is going to walk you through some tips and ideas to help make your Canvas gradebook a little bit more user friendly as we start the semester. So one of the first things I do is I go up to view and I like to hide those unpublished assignments. I don't need to see them until students have seen them. So I'm going to go ahead and uncheck unpublished assignments. The next thing I do is I like to go to the very end of my gradebook all the way to the end. And I like to see that total column. It defaults to the end for some reason. So I'm going to click the three dots and I'm going to move that total to the front so it looks a little bit more like Skyward and I have a nice little view of how each student is doing. Next, let's talk about how you might arrange your assignments. So I like to go to view and you can arrange by any method that makes sense for you. I like to arrange by module so that way um, things are grouped for me in my gradebook like they are for students. It's nice and organized or you might arrange them by um, due date, however it works for you. And then lastly, filters are super awesome. So a very popular filter is filtering by section. So this really helps with grading. So that way you can see one section at a time instead of one mass group. And then there's also some great ways to filter um, by assignment groups potentially. So if you wanna see how students are doing just on their summatives, um, you get a nice little view of just summative assessments. So hopefully that gets you going. One last little tip before I go is I want to encourage all of you to check out the Canvas mobile app either on your mobile device or potentially an iPad. It's a really great way to get through SpeedGrader and grade um, very easily and quickly versus grading on your computer. So if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. I'm happy to help.